can't see anything. My glasses are all <laughs> fogged up. Oh no! We're at Nadra Kingdom. I got my spirit jersey mask on. And we're excited to see all the Christmas things. <laughs> So we just saw the castle, the new colors, and I absolutely love it. The tops were looking very purple in pictures, and I feel like they don't now. So happy to see that. Cover your mouth and nose when coughing and sneezing, and maintain physical distancing. Thank you for your cooperation. We are walking on Space Ranger Spin. Guys, I was this close, this close to getting Galactic Hero. What she won't tell you though is that the ride broke down for 10 minutes and she sat there spamming the same <laughs> target right in front of her for the whole 10 minutes. An almost Galactic Hero never discloses their secrets. How many years ago today was it? 2016, so four. Alright, we're walking over because four years ago today, Phil proposed to me. He said, come with me, and took me to this very spot. So if you look at the stage here, and then you have to turn, and it was right over here, near these benches. And the people mover was right in front of us. Phil says the exact spot was right here. We got a guest apparently engaged in front of where dogs take a crap. <laughs> what does that say about our marriage? <laughs> I think everyone already knows about our marriage. <laughs> Next up, we are going on Astro Orbiter. Phil has never been on this ride, and I don't think I've been on this ride since high school. So I'm excited to go back on it. Astro Orbiter was actually closed, so we are going into the Tomorrowland Power Company to check out some of the merch. There was a cookie jar of Space Mountain that we thought looked really cool. It's right over here. Our bedroom is Tomorrowland theme, so we want a cookie jar in our bedroom. Why not? Cookie jar right here. And in fact, all this stuff is really cute.
Love this. Just look at the crowds right now. I mean, I feel like it's very spotty, like it's empty here. I'll be interested to see what it's like in Fantasyland. Storybrook Circus. It's really book, but I always say brook. Here is the Tron construction. It looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. Alright, Phil's in the bathroom, so I'm going on Barnstormer by myself. I've never been on this. I've always wanted to go, so I'm excited. A little closer up here. Goes very far back. Wait. 
got the Bell's Enchanted Tree. I was excited to try this. I love macarons. Mm. That's nice. It's like, it does have a nice raspberry flavor. A little lemon too in there. The one in France is definitely better, but not significantly better. So if they have the tree and you're here, Maybe next Christmas. Definitely give it a try. I let, I'm enjoying this. See, there's like a little raspberry paste in there. Oh yeah, there is. See, there's like a little raspberry paste in there. It's very delicious. It was really good. It was way better than I was expecting. I'm not a huge macaron fan as it is, but uh, I really enjoyed the one we had at France yesterday, and this one was almost as good. The only reason that I like the other one more is because it was cold. I don't know why, but that matters. I can't articulate <laughs> why, but it matters at this moment. And I just... Did you like the fresh I berries think, yes, too? Yes, I prefer the fresh berries and I like the more like lemon, meringue, like It was filling. smoother. This one is a little more firm of a filling. That which one, is, yeah. It's still very, very, very good. Yeah. So, tasted fresh, although it likely wasn't. Um, but hey, as long as it tasted fresh, definitely worth the five bucks it cost. And what are your overall thoughts of Magic Kingdom today? This is probably one of my favorite Magic Kingdom days ever because nobody's here. Everyone's probably over at Epcot. Yeah. And we did that yesterday, so I feel like Pauline planned this out perfectly. All right, we just swung by Tomorrowland Power Authority. Phil got a customized Magic Band. They're starting to get more and more really good ones, so definitely check them out if you don't like the magic bands that they have on display. And now we're gonna go to Casey's and get corn dog nuggets. Bill loves Casey's. All right, we're going into Casey's. Casey's is closed. So we are going to get spring rolls, which we have never ever done and I'm so excited about. It's good? Is it like a cheeseburger? It is. It tastes almost like a McDonald's cheeseburger. So instead of Casey's we got the cheeseburger and pepperoni egg rolls. So this one's pepperoni and then this one is the cheeseburger. So they give you ketchup and mustard with the cheeseburger 
and some marinara sauce with the pepperoni. So we just finished up with our egg rolls and we got the cheeseburger egg rolls and the pepperoni pizza egg rolls. They're actually spring rolls. I keep calling them egg rolls. Spring rolls, whatever. Um, the cheeseburger rolls were the better of the two by far, the pepperoni pizza rolls, but are, are, were very strange. I'm from Western New York and we have pizza logs, which is basically like egg roll, like an egg roll wrapper and like cheese and pepperoni rolled up inside of them deep fried, which is amazing. And these pale in comparison to that, so I'm spoiled in that regard. The cheeseburger rolls were really good. I, I mean, from all the hype that we get, like how like quote unquote famous they are, I was expecting something a little bit better. They were okay. They were definitely the better of the two, but they were just okay. I think that they're one of the most overhyped things I've experienced in Disney. So, unpopular opinion, I'm sure, but that's how I feel about it. I totally disagree with Phil and cheeseburger egg rolls. I really enjoyed them. I think they're a great option. Um, I don't know if they're that super hyped up, but I thought they were really good and totally worth getting, and I would get them again, like multiple times over again. I agree about the pizza logs, so we have pizza, or the pizza <laughs> spring rolls, because we have pizza logs. Those are way better. And I think what was missing from the pizza spring rolls was cheese. There was no cheese in it. If it had cheese, it'd be way better. Also, this is the view of the castle from our table. Castle views are the best views. It's the most wonderful time. Magic. I can't remember if I told you, <laughs> but now we are walking through Fantasyland. I gotta tell you, it's literally empty here right now and two seconds ago it was packed. It's very fluctuating with the crowds, which is never, ever, ever the case around Christmas. This is like 
you can barely get through at Christmas and now there's like no one here but a couple more minutes ago it was kind of packed so very sporadic with the crowds now did I tell you we're going to Haunted Mansion because that's where we're going looked on the app it was only a 10 minute wait so it's going on over there all right we're going into Haunted Frontierland at the Frontier Trading Post because they got really good pins here. some rocking chair time and then Mickey came by again so I did a little live video on Instagram and now we're going to ye old Christmas shop this store smells so good I want it as a candle this is the best smell I've had on the trip so far. We are getting some fresh popcorn over here by the castle. Castle. And then we're gonna see if we can get the merch that we sent to the front of the park. They said that they don't open until two, which seems kind of late to me, but eh, we'll, we'll see what we can do. If we need to come back later tonight, we could always do that too. I wouldn't mind coming back and seeing like the castle lit up and all that fun stuff tonight. All right guys, we left Magic Kingdom. We're in line at the boat launch in some popcorn because it's delish. Uh, and we are waiting for the boat to get to the Polynesian because we didn't get to go to the Boutique, which is probably our favorite gift shop in Disney World. Uh, it was closed when we went down after dinner, so excited to check out the boutique. -y. 